Welcome everybody back to another bold cast reaction. I'm Carson. I'm Lindsay. And this is Donjo Meshi. Episode 13, Red Dragon 3 slash Good Medicine. Hmm. What do you think is going to happen this time? I don't know. Excellent analysis. <laughs> Excellent predictions. Um... Uh, Anything else you want to say? <laughs> um, we do have the 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 elf uh, mage person right. coming in. You know, we've met up with other parties throughout the dungeon, so I'm wondering if maybe that that one group of people that kept getting killed might show up sometime soon. I don't know, but there's only one way to find out. And that's to leave like and subscribe, and enjoy this reaction. Let's go. I'm when they ate one of those. Mm -hmm. In D and D, those are like good guys. Mm -mm. They're, I think they're like uh, chaotic good or law, maybe even, no, not lawful good. They're probably chaotic good or neutral good mm. little guys. They're called myconids or myconoids. But morality doesn't really matter when you're hungry in the That was ter- this is crazy scary. Uh, what? What are you doing? I knew it, this girl ain't right. Oh shit. What? What? What the hell's going on? Oh, she got like combined with the dragon somehow. Yeah. I mean, they took the life force of the or like the physical body of the dragon, but. Oh no. Oh. Okay, Jesus. I thought that was falling for a second. <laughs> oh, it kind of is. Well, that's why, maybe that's why the dragon was out? The dragon was supposed to be searching for? Mm, maybe. That's spooky. Or maybe when she was a ghost. She... Oh. It's cool with me. Oh. Oh, the paintings. I don't know what to tell you, but... If this was all just because of that, I mean... Dragon. Book. I don't like the look of that. Is it the same incantation? Whoa. Or a similar one? It's forbidden elf magic. Shit. Blood magic. She needs to fight fire with fire. Whoa! Whoa, whoa! Like, turn undead. Kinda. Wait, what? Oh, it's being drawn to it? Oh, well. All our food. God damn it, you spent like hours preparing that meat. I didn't think, I. you predicted it. I really did not think we were gonna run into this person right now. Uh. Hmm. 
Oh no. What? Oh no. What is happening with this show right now? <laughs> what is this, Star Wars? I don't know, figure it out. Oh my god. Oh no. Why didn't Chill Chuck go first? <laughs> there can be orcs around or something? God damn it. Are they good ghosts? Maybe they like falling. And they're like trying to help her. Maybe. If we're really lucky. Senshi's felt uh, very distant the last few episodes. Mm -hmm. Is that just me? Yeah, that works. <laughs> <laughs> She's from EOP. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I've always wanted to try. Uh, uh. <laughs> Those Sonata, Zonzo, Chono, Yamoto, Waru, Zoktio, Tono, Yakos, Tanin, Kita, Kanda, Nasutio, Moto, Azes, Mono, 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 Definitely a concoction. It's like a healing potion or like a tribal healing stew. <laughs> the tremor in her breath. <laughs> All the breathing. <laughs> <laughs> well, she's dead. What do we do now? We don't have the dragon. <laughs> About you. Really? But but, He's basically uh, saying, like, if you don't have the stomach yeah. for it, then just go. You're not gonna... Like, I can't force you to do anything. I'm sure he didn't want to go too just to get his pan and stuff. He's a real one, man. Unless he's been quiet because he's gonna leave. Why does that keep happening? Mm. Mm. 
That's really interesting. Mm-hmm. How are they still sane? They've been here for like a long time. Mm-hmm. Well, maybe they lived here. Well, yeah, later. but then they've been ghosts here for like a long time, mm-hmm. just like trapped here. You figure they wouldn't be, still be sane. Mm hmm. You are lucky. <laughs> the dogs. They're really cute. I really like those dogs. <laughs> They're good dogs. Pure luck, basically. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> She's so funny. Mm -hmm. <笑>無理をすれば報われると思い込んで、<笑> <laughs> How did it end up there? What got dragged away? Fallen's new body, probably. Mm. <laughs> ヒルちゃん、考えたのは私が。まずは俺から話させてくれ。ライオス。今のお前の心中は察するに余りある。以上の探索は今の俺たちに無理だ。必ず誰か死ぬ。頼む。ライオス。ここは耐えて戻って。
And I'm sure she'll be some kind of like dragon person hybrid, like with wings and a tail and some scaly body and multiple legs maybe or something. Yeah, I don't know. And then every, everyone got thrown into that pit, but then the ghosts keep saving them. Because mm -hmm. the ghosts, the ghosts probably want to help them because if they can defeat the magician, then they'll be set free. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Like, they probably are sick of just being trapped there for eternity mm -hmm. for no reason. I wonder if the ghosts also like falling because uh, of her... Spiritual connection. Yeah. yeah. I don't know. I like this um, with the, the concoction. Mm -hmm. um, that was funny. But yeah, I I was not expecting something so crazy. Like this guy just showing up, ma making all these blood dragon creatures. Like you know. Yeah, I was not. Expecting it, was, it. I was. It just took such. A, I I feel like I I have not even still been able to process it because it was just so. And then Marcia crazy. like going all crazy yeah. with a laugh, like using like it uh, sort of a anti or like ne anti necromancy like undoing the spell yeah and like having getting in all of a frenzy about it it was kind of crazy and then her staff broke mm -hmm. yeah it was that, like the first part of this episode was absolutely crazy mm -hmm. and, and then it was a lot of reflection for chill chuck and mm -hmm. everything but and apparently they're gonna to head die. back which is, uh, yeah maybe get shura and namari or shuro and namari that could be interesting if they came back with a, a bit of a bigger party mm -hmm. and then made the goal, you know, getting get falling, falling again, again or and, uh, you know, maybe just defeat the dungeon. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But what if the, the end thing is like, oh, you can't defeat the dungeon because like it's an ecosystem now. Like it's it's so many people rely on it for mut for work and for money and trade and all this stuff. Like it's a it's a part of the it's like a huge part of the economy to, you know, it, it, the whole thing of the in ecosystem, the circle of life and all like, oh, this this thing exists because mm -hmm. these smaller things exist and they feed or they have a relationship or they, you know, whatever. Like maybe that will be the thing where at the end they they can't they need or maybe they need to like defeat the mage without or or convince the mage to stop being fucking evil and just like keep the dungeon or something I don't know. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it seems kind of wrong after like all of the stuff we've learned about it after learning of all all the orcs and all the people who subsist with the dungeon and all the different animals and cultures that exist down there like it mm -hmm. it, it seems kind of against the what the show is kind of about to just delete everything you know mm -hmm. doesn't that seem kind of wrong like with is with, that what happens when you defeat the dungeon i can't even really remember at this point like do you, well it becomes yours if you oh. defeat the, the mage they say it becomes yours but um i don't know I, I, we just know that the the mage is is the one who who's creating and and keeping everything mm -hmm. like this. So, but maybe they can just free the dungeon from the curse of spirits and stuff like that, and still mm -hmm. everything will just continue as normal. But like that that curse is what allows people to go and like plunder it and yeah um, get resources and things. So I don't know. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Yeah. A, a lot of the episode was kind of like not a recap, but a sort of. Like, you know, there was the big thing at the start and then it was kind of just reflecting mm -hmm. on a lot of stuff, so. Yeah, and now, like, I, I didn't know where it was gonna go and now it's it's almost like we're back to square one. I mean, yeah. Like, we gotta save Fallen and we don't have the stuff to do it, so we gotta go out of the dungeon and then come back down. Yeah. But we'll be able to speed run it this time because the orcs are gonna, like, help us navigate yeah. and get us to where we need to go because uh, they made an impression on, on this girl and on the... Mm -hmm. things, so. Which is really They'll good. They'll be able to go a lot faster. Mm -hmm. And they obviously already know a lot of uh, kind of hacks about how to get past certain things or yeah. certain areas to avoid or not waste your time on. Mm -hmm. Wow. Good episode. It was it was good. I just I, I feel like I'm kind of stunned like by all that, like all of that they get her back. And then just immediately. Mm -hmm. just, I mean, we could tell something wasn't right from the beginning. Yeah. I didn't think that we were going to run into the elf right away. No, I thought I thought it was going to be, like I said that at the start of the episode, but I had originally been thinking, oh, like the elf is now kind of not on their, like they're kind of on the elf's radar and we're going to see how it goes for a little bit and then there's going to be an altercation. Mm -hmm. But nope, it just went all out. And I wonder if we're going to see more of that perspective or more to do with falling like now that we found her again or if it's just going to remain a complete mystery 
uh, until they get down to this level again, you know? I feel like it's gonna be pretty speed run. We're probably gonna be back down to this level in like two or three episodes. I hope so. I think, I don't think we're gonna spend, unless we have to take like a different route or something, but. Mm -hmm. I don't know, yeah, from a writing thing, I don't know if this, if what the, what the idea is here. Did it, was it like, cause a lot of the sort of extra, a lot of the stuff with like, the greater plot stuff didn't start getting introduced and well, I mean it was kind of there the whole time like with the with the intro sequence mm -hmm. but like all the stuff with the elves and ancient things like it's been seeded somewhat throughout but the idea of the story going past saving fallen was was sort of on very much on the back burner yeah. I, I guess it would take an, an like a deeper dive and like you know, oh, there's a mention of this here, uh, this chapter or whatever. Mm -hmm. But it seemed like it became more of a plot thread or it, like they're more towards when we got to the dragon, uh, there seemed to be more backstory or like plot, plot heavy yeah. stuff like leading towards extending the story past just getting, defeating the dragon, getting yeah. fallen back, defeating the, the mage or whatever. Mm -hmm. So I wonder if this was always planned. It's, it, it, very, it very well could have been. I, I, think, I think it probably it was. It probably could have been. It could have also been um, like a manga thing where it's, okay, I want the story to keep going, but I'm going to, like, make a suitable ending point if it gets, like, cut. Like, yeah. oh, if, if we get, if we find Falling and then it gets canceled, then, mm -hmm. you know. Well, and also, it, like, it'll depend on what happens after this. Is 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 it, is it a, a way to sort of get more life and more length out of this manga series? Like, uh, you know, it just, we kind of get beat down here. We lose, we, we lose, and now we have to go back and is it going to be speed running to this point again after we resupply and like reflect on stuff and get other people mm -hmm. involved? Or is it going to be, um, oh, you know, we got to, now we got to go a different path. So then it's a opportunity to explore other, other dishes and other mm -hmm. places and stuff like that. Or is it going to be like fully into the whole like rescuing fallen thing yeah. and, and less of the slow burn sort of adventure style? Yeah. Um, you know that that'll be really interesting. So I, I guess what I what I meant when when I was bringing up like is this a way to extend it? Is you know I wonder if the author was thinking, oh here's an opportunity for me to like slow it back down to what the so series was more focused yeah. on in the first half of you know meals and cooking and stuff like that and exploration and ecosystems. Can I is this a way where I can put that back into the story as a main forefront for sh for a short time before getting back into the plot, or is it just you know this was always the plan and it is now like fully uh you know mm -hmm. way more plot focused i guess i don't know mm -hmm. i don't know it's very it's just kind of interesting to think about what uh, what's going through the author's head maybe and i guess what it'll it, depending on how how things slow down or continue to speed up over this next sort of interstice interstitial arc thing that's going to be for like the next few episodes where we get mm -hmm. back on our feet and try to go back you know is this is the next the rest of the show until we see fall again is it going to be like kind of like a, a darker sort of more sinister or like kind of a not a repeat but a sort of recoloring of the similar journey we went on but with seeing different locations mm -hmm. different animals or whatever or is it going to be uh you know we're, we're going full on into the into the plot stuff yeah. I, either way, it'll be really interesting, but there's a couple of different places, ways you can go with, with things at this point. Because it's kind of like a cutoff, like we lost, you know, full reset, kind of. Not really, yeah. but kind of. Mm -hmm. But I'm, I'm excited for yeah. either, whether they whether they choose to go more plot heavy or whatever. Mm -hmm. I agree. Love it. Leave a like and subscribe. See you guys next time. I'm Carson. I'm Lindsay. Bye-bye.